world's worst coat hanger. Hello everybody, I'm Miss Maman and welcome back to my channel. It's been so long. It has been since Valentine's Day where I released my last video. Things got a little bit crazy and now the world is going crazy. So my life is sort of reflecting off that. But long story short, I got completely held up with so much prep for Pin Up Doll Australia. I will be having a separate video on that later on, hopefully this week, if something arrives in the mail. But until then, I am just going to keep carrying on with my normal content and welcome back. I've missed you. How have you been? Are you safe? Are you in your homes? Do not leave your house. It is time to hermit and craft and drink tea and try to stop snacking. Yeah, that's not going well for me either. Anyway, today we are going to be pretending we can leave the house. Luckily, I filmed some of this footage before the lockdown really kicked in. And we are going to be reviewing some Mrs. Maisel dresses from Heart My Closet. This is the iconic pink coat. I fell in love with this entire outfit. It is pink on pink on pink. And I think it is an absolutely beautifully designed and styled coat. I opted for this shade of pink as I think it's a little bit more flattering and I have a lot more deeper toned accessories I could pair with it. So that's sort of where my mind went. But in general, it is everything. The coat has this really lovely wide collar, pink buttons, which have sort of like a resiny sheen to it. It is fully lined with a 1950s, 60s swing style. It goes down all the way to my knees, which means I can wear any of my dresses with it and I won't have my dress peeking up the bottom. I found the fit to be absolutely perfect. So Harma Closet can actually do custom fittings to your sizes, which is what I had done with this one. But because it's a swing coat, you do have a little bit more leeway. This is probably one of my favorite new things for the cooler months. And I paired it with this true vintage dress. I didn't have a pink Mrs. Maisel dress to match, but I will rectify that very shortly. The next dress we have is this lovely green and blue number. Now Midge wears this dress in the third season and she looks absolutely wonderful in it. At first I wasn't sure about the colour combination because as they say, blue and green should not be seen without a colour in between, but I threw caution to the wind and thought, yep, I'll give it a go, and I absolutely love it. The dress fits really beautifully on the body. I'm a big fan of the triangle cutout under the bust. I think it came out so flattering and I love how that blue is continued into the bow accents. It was really well fitted, really thick material. It is not lined, but it doesn't become see-through when stretched or over curvy parts. It was just really comfortable. It was just so lovely to wear. I had a lot of compliments in the time I wore it, even just for this little shoot. And I paired it with some blue accessories to really bring in that green and blue theme. The last Mrs. Maisel dress was this two-piece set. The base of this dress is just this very simple sort of shift dress. It has cat sleeved, darted bodice, and it's got an A-line skirt. That's the word we want. The bottom covering is a skirt. That is the shift's dress, which is really stunning on its own. But the piece that is a stance is this super cute little coat that goes over the top of it. So much like the pink jacket, it's got a similar collar. It's got a little bow at the front and buttons. The dress and the coat are fully lined, which make it really comfortable. The fabric is beautiful, luscious and thick. I just found it so flattering, so much fun to wear. I would love to dye a pair of gloves and a hat to match this sort of colour. So what do we think about these Mrs. Maisel dresses? As a huge fan of the series, I think it's a lot of fun to be able to put on these garments and have my own sort of midge day. 
I think that they are so beautifully designed. They are taken from true vintage inspirations, but just the way they are made and the quality I have found to be great, even if a button fell off, but you know. Regardless, they are a great way to get ready for events, cosplaying, Halloween. I know it's way too early to be thinking about Halloween, said no one ever. But it's never too late to sort of have these fun, cute pieces in your wardrobe. And they can just sort of really boost your mood. I know that putting on that grey silver blue dress outfit, I love it. It is the dress I have worn the most out of all three of these pieces and I do not see myself stopping to wear it. I just love it. It is so beautiful. And that is everything I have from Heart My Closet to review for you today. Reviewing Mrs. Maisel items and things is a lot of fun. I actually had one pre-recorded which I just never got around to finishing so I will be uploading that also very soon. I don't want too much Mrs. Maisel content all clumped in together but I really just wanted to show off these dresses first. Until then I will see you guys all in the next video. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you'd like to follow me on my journey you may subscribe and follow me on any of my social media. I'd love to have you along for this adventurous pin-up glamorous journey is just full of tomfoolery and many ha bad hair days so just come along for the ride just just come it's fine you don't have to tell anyone just come just come i will see you guys all very soon but look after yourselves and each other i'm sending you all lots of love bye <laughs>